part of uh, being an artist is you get fed up with yourself. So you just go, fuck it, I might as well really talk. Right, um, right. You lose the comic rhythm and you start getting actually funny and getting the need the to honest. crush. The need to crush. And I think yeah. getting back to our subject that's happened in some degree with this filmmaker because he started with the, the heartache just going like, here's where, here's how my voice sounds. Here's how I look at things. Here's how I film stuff. Here's how I use music and cutting. And here's, and, and what he had underneath that grew and grew over time was the ability to have actors live with a really sad, just a tragic sadness and to see the value in actors that weren't exactly kicking ass in other areas yet. Uh, and then Boogie Nights was his like, I'm in Hollywood and I got Marky Mark and I got Burt Reynolds and I'm going to make this John Holmes movie. And it, the whole second half is going to be so dark and violent and it's going to be a mess, man. And the first half of it is just beautiful to me. And it's just my feeling. Yeah. Second half, I just didn't care about, but I knew I was watching a guy who's extremely special and, and learning, but it, he only got richer and richer and richer after that. 